Hello my little pine salts and welcome to a new YouTube video. Today we're actually in stream recording this, so chat can say hi if they want to, if they're not too shy. <laughs> and yeah, we will be trying out this game and see how it goes and see if I actually like it or not. <laughs> so, 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 then I will say we will directly go into the game. I've already heard that it's like a little bit hard to figure out stuff. So we will see how long we will need for that. And if I will have to edit a lot. So the graphics are... They're fine. <laughs> the graphics are fine. We are going as if we have a stick in our butt. And running is the same. But well, that's okay, I guess. We'll just be going... Um, towards here, I guess? That seems like the best thing to do. So, dressage ad. Let's check that one out. Oh. Private coaching. Private dressage oh. coaching. I wonder how much that costs. Maybe I should get a job before the fall. That would definitely help to get, to get, uh, Shit, I can't, I can't go like backwards. That's kind of weird. Don't fly her. I'm gonna be spending so much time with my classmates, and I really hope they don't suck. That would actually be sad. That would actually be sad if if that would like suck. So a note: I am Robin, soon to be college student, looking for part-time work. Can work any hour, night shift, etc. Only excluding school hours. Have worked in farms and stables and done loads of manual labor in general, lifting and loading, warehouse work, landscaping, etc. I have a car license, B plus E, and a tractor license. Robin Sonderwick, call me on this number. Okay, okay. Interesting, interesting. Internship. Call internship at FHS. The Federation of Horse Sports is looking for motivated and passionate interns for the upcoming fall season. This is a unique opportunity to gain hands-on experience in the world of equestrian sport management. The internship during is, uh, duration is five months starting in October. Our office is located in the city of Rain Ravine, Trotter Avenue 13A to C1938 Rain Ravine, with great public transport access. Students are recent graduates with completed studies in at least two of the following are illegible to apply equine sports event management equine industry economics and financial management inter internal international relationships in equestrian sports equine welfare and re regulatory compliance compliance equine law and ethics history and culture of equi equitrian Equestrianism. Oh my god. Anti-doping policies and equestrianism, sustainable practices in equestrian facility management, media relations, and communication in equine sports. Plus, fluency in English is required. Proficiency in French, German, Spanish, Italian, or Portuguese is beneficial. The position is unpaid. Damn, you have you have to be good. You have to be really good, but you don't get much. <laughs> That's what I'm getting from this. Um, more details on our website. If you're interested, please send your resume and brief cover letter through our website form. FHS, Federation of Horse Sports. Okay. Good to know, good to know. So, how about we look at the tax store ad? Updating your gear for the next semester. Our summer student discount, minus 8%. Right, uh, ravine village settle masters good to know if i want to like get new ones then cherry peak stables, cherry peak stables? that's where my mom bought the gift card oh writing lessons so we will have our writing lessons at cherry peak stables and let's look at that one as well notice from our partner stable grünhof heights equestrian center grünhof heights Staff would like to inform you that our equestrian center will be temporarily out of business beginning in June to undergo important renovations and changes to our management structures. All lessons and shows are on pause for the time being. Some of our 
School horses have been relocated to work in other barns for the summer, while others are enjoying a well-deserved rest in the paddocks. We plan on getting back to business in the upcoming autumn. Monika Grunhold. Okay, she's probably German, because Grunhold is German. It means green... Green, um... My brain just fired it. Green... How do you say Hof in fucking English again? Green... Green, yes. Mm -hmm. Green hole. <laughs> so, no trespassing. Rain, marine, equine. Like, what do you mean no trespassing? I kind of have to go there, right? Oh, mailbox. You're all mail. Those goofy mailboxes look just like I remember. I guess they are goofy. Okay. So, it doesn't really tell you anything. Like, where the fuck do I have to go? Do I have to do anything? And I heard of that already, that that is like really annoying. Can I jump or something? No. Let's see. Let's see, let's see. What is this gonna tell us? Mm hmm, mm hmm. Chair peak. Oh! I didn't sign up to run a marathon today. Excuse me? Let's just sleep with us. Okay. Um, bus schedule. Oh, I can't go backwards. That is so annoying. Do I have to, like, sit down? Do I have to... What do I have to do? Um, yeah, we have to gift card. We have a horse girl's handbook. Okay, let's how about we just read that first. Welcome here, horse girls, pony boys, all the hay folk. This small handbook is here to guide you through basics of equestrianism. So grab your helmet, sight on your girth, and let's trot into the wonderful and sometimes bumpy world of horse riding. Complete riding lessons to unlock more pages. Oh, beautiful. Grand Prix. And dressage, often described the dance of the equestrian world as more than just a series of movements. It is the ultimate expression of partnerships, balance, and communication. This book was written to guide writers through the foundational principles of the dressage discipline, all the way from level one novice uh, to a Grand Prix master. An introductory level of English writing knowledge is assumed from the reader. And we have to complete more shit. Okay, we can't really click anything else. Um, yeah, I'm kind of... I'm kind of um, lost. <laughs> I've heard that a lot of people, um, Green Yard, yeah, I think Green Yard makes most sense. Thanks so much. I don't know when you posted that in chat, but I, I just saw it. I'm so sorry. But yeah, we kind of have to figure out how to take this stupid bus. Oh. <laughs> You have multiple things here that you can. Wow. Time to arrive at Cherry Peak. Wow. Oh. From the University to Cherry Peak. God. Oh, I should go check it out. Oh my God. Wow. New info discovered. This is terrible. Oh gosh. Well, well, well. Well, look at this. We are taking the bus. Oh god. Um, this looks like Cherry Peak Stables. It's pretty. It's pr actually okay. It's actually pretty. The gate is actually really pretty. It's actually really pretty. How about we look at the info here? I mean, we just have one thing. Summer course info. Nee. <laughs> nee. 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 Nay, are you new here and attending our summer course? Head over to the barn to check out the lesson timetables and the horse assignment list. If you already know which arena your lesson is in, you can find the corresponding timetables posted near the arena entrance. Okay, then hopefully it will now be easier for us to find it. Also, just a heads up to all the non-subscribers, there was going to be an ad in around 5 minutes. Also, I can already see the first horsey! Oh my god. Oh, look at that. We actually can see the horse here. That is actually so cool. Hi. 
Hello there. That is so cute. Is it a pedo? Is it like sniffing the ground? Expecting the ants or something? Okay, um, let's check this out first. Is this where we have to go? Probably not, right? Okay, no, we can't go in here. So we will probably have to go all the way up. So that's just gonna be what we're gonna do. Up we go, up we go. Da, 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 da. So, so. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. We have to walk quite a, quite a while, but hey, that's okay. Look, look at us uh, walking as if we have to pee. <laughs> Uh, but well. Do I have to go here or up there? This feels more right, right? I think? I think this way is better. Let's just do it. Let's just go this way and see. Look at all the cherry blossoms! That's so pretty! actually really cute it's actually really cute cherry peak staples just a little pasture in the pasture like a little paddock here a nice car some dirt or something oh do we go up here do we we're like breaking in now okay Barn loft. Ooh, let's go into the barn loft. Oh, okay. Why are we like so stiff? They're horsies. Let's quickly let's quickly go look at them. I love the <laughs> wisps of hair. Very uh beautiful. <laughs> Oh. oh, hi there! Hi, horsies! Hi! Blaze. Hi, Blaze. Hi, Crimson Blaze. Beautiful. Hi, Ghost. Hello, Ghost. Hi, hi. Hello, Tatiana. Hello. Hello, Tati. Oh, Tati is really pretty. She has blue eyes. It's so pretty. Hi, Tati. Do we have another one here? Bluebell. Hi, Bluebell. Oh, Bluebell is a peebold. At least I think so. Or an overall. I'm not sure. Peri Rose. Okay, Peri Rose is probably being ridden somewhere right now. But hey, that's really nice. Oh, I can actually open it. Can I? Oh, I can rent Blaze. Oh, I can like... Ah, I can rent... Um, can I also close it again, or... I guess I cannot close it again? I think I want... Oh, I mean, Tati is really pretty, but... but Why can I not ride ghosts? But Blaze is, like, really big, and I like big horses. This one I also couldn't open, right? No, Bluebell I also couldn't open. Tati or Blaze? I think I'll go with Blaze. Rent. Just on the wall, I need to take lessons first to rent the horses. Oh. I have to find where I have to go to actually start my lesson. Let's see. Let's see if we'll find it. I'm actually just running back and forth. Let's just go in and see. If we find any lesson board here. Is that the lesson board? Oh! Oh, yeah. It is. Note from someone. Horses. Man, I wish I had money for that too. <laughs> True. Maybe one day. 
True, true, true. Mm. All the work of Tachi in the jumping arena. Exercise of place in the flat work arena. Not just start your uh, ride of the day. Enter the box of your chosen horse. Focus on the horse to choose to rent for today. The equipment for setting up horses can be found in the corner of the arena. Interested in improving your riding skills solo? Our new daily horse renting program offers frequent riders the opportunity to rent the school horses on days when they are working less. The av availability of each horse as well as the available facilities varies daily depending on our lesson schedule. You're free to create your own exercise courses using your flat work and jumping equipment as long as you can clean up after. That's actually really cool. If you can actually like do that, that's really cool. The minimum requirement for renting is that you must have completed our Riding Essentials course as well as gotten a permission from Paola Giordano, Giordano, Giordano to rent said horse. Okay, nice, nice. And then we can look at book a riding uh, lesson. Riding Essentials Summer Course. Our Riding Essentials course is perfect for novice riders leveling up from lesson ponies to higher trained horses or those returning to the saddle after a while. Additionally, all newcomers to, to the stables are required to take this course for a thorough assessment of your riding skills. This course focuses on the very basics of flat work, including transitions between gates, ex um, effective use of seat, leg and rein aids, and how to work with a responsive horse. Training with our ex expert instructor, Paola Giordano. Limited space is available. Enroll today. So, introduction to Cherry Peak. Let's do that. It's going to take 14 minutes. 14 minutes of that. Okay. We are Tati. Is everything alright with the stirrups? Do you need any help? Mm, seems fine, I think. Ah, okay, okay. Uh huh. Okay, continue. And did you check the guard too? It should be on the third hole on both sides, no looser than that. It looks right. Okay, then it sounds fine. Nice, nice. I reckon you have some previous experience, but how much could you say exactly? Funny enough, like zero. Years, <laughs> have you acquired any riding badges, for instance? In real life, not much. <laughs> Done like some riding lessons back back when I was little. Not like little, little. I was like um, fourteen or something. Right, but then at so some point I couldn't four, anymore. Four, five years in a riding school in Wyoming. I guess so. Uh, haven't done any batches yet. No batches. Uh, so you're from the States, huh? I guess I am. Half and half? Your mom's from here originally. You know, it's a very international community we have here in Rain Ravine. And was that English writing you did in Wyoming? I don't know. Mostly English, okay. all right. English, okay. Oh, that's where he's... Oh, she's sitting back there. Interesting. I've never done, like, a single writing lessons like, like this, so it's all fucking new to me. And... I did hear people say that actually also did have normal writing lessons in real life, that it's really accurate to real life. So, I'm really excited well, to see that. Regardless of your previous experience, our writing essentials course here always starts from the very basics of writing. Mm -hmm. The reason we do this is because there's always some differences in how different schools mm -hmm. train mm -hmm. their horses. Very true. We want you to get used to our style. And I want to be able to assess your riding level to place you in the right group. Okay? Continue. I haven't seen you here before, so I'm assuming this is your first time here. Is that correct? Mm hmm mm hmm yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, in that case, I should probably introduce myself a bit to you. Uh, my name's Paula. Mm -hmm. I'm a senior riding coach here at Cherry Peak. Very nice. Uh, I mainly teach flat work and I have an FHS coach certification, if, if that says anything to you. Doesn't tell me anything, but hey. Oh, FH FHS was like the horse sport facility thing. That we saw. FHS, on... in case you don't know, is the Federation of Horse Sports. Yes, yes. They do operate in the States too, but might be more prominent here in Europe. 
Sorry, one more question. Yeah. Um, I forgot to double check your name. Uh, I have your name listed in my papers as Avani Prasad. Is that correct? Ava for short. Okay. okay I'm Avani Prasad. That's our name. Or Ava. Nice to meet you, Ava. Nice, nice. I, I think this is enough of the blabbering. We should stop now because the clock is ticking. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Let's start, let's start. What are the three riding aids that you most respond to? Legs, reins, and seat. Oh. The legs main mm -hmm. purpose is to tell your horse to switch up a gate. And then we have the reins. The reins main purpose is to turn your horse. Very simple, to turn right, use the right rein, to turn left, to use the left rein. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's get you guys going and I'll explain further. Okay, okay, very good, very good. To tell Tati to start walking, press her sides with both your legs and ah. keep that pressure for a moment. So not a quick tap, but slightly sustained. Ah. Okay. Okay. Wait, eight. Uh, oh, okay. Gosh. Do you mean right rain? I will go into the thing if I do right rain now. Hee, we're riding a horse. Pressing down as on the touchy holes to stop. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay. We're starting to walk again. I have made oh. a small turn. Oh, gosh. Oh. Bigger. Okay, okay. In this exercise, I want to see Tati in active walk with some length in the stride. Keep her neatly between the cones. Okay, okay. Press one, go. Button. I would love to do this in real life so much. That would be like a dream come true. To be honest, the longer I play it, the less the quality is like annoying me. The less annoying the quality gets. That's how how I would say it. Because unfortunately, I am um, very unfair towards horse games. Because I always compare them to Red Dead Online. And of course, of course, they're not going to be on the same level because it's fucking Rockstar. They have, like, they have the money. And normally, the makers and developers of horse games don't really have that financial um, start, basically. So I shouldn't really put that like on the same level. The last thing we have to go through today. When you're turning Tati, do you notice that like, can you feel how she's a bit sluggish in the turning? Like slow. Yeah. Well this I is guess. because even though yes, your ranks are the primary turning aid, they're actually not the only one. I mean, yeah, you lose like your legs. To well. make your horse do sharper turns, you need to in fact support the turning with your legs alongside with the brain. So there's mm -hmm. that your leg is a secondary turning aid. Mm -hmm. In walk, you might survive with the rain alone in most situations. Mm -hmm. 
But when you get to faster gates, especially counter, you notice that the leg support becomes more and more needed. Uh huh, uh huh. Okay, so I have to always do like the opposite. But that makes sense. That makes sense. Well, well. Yeah, that, that works, I guess. This is what writing's all about. It's about using your aids in harmony with each other. Nice, nice, There's nice. There's really very few things you can do by just using one aid at a time. Now, a very important thing about the leg turning cues is that Unlike with the right, the leg aids need to be applied from the opposite side of the oh. <laughs> She's still telling this us that now we're already always like already doing all that. But think about it like this. Imagine I come and push on your right shoulder. Where are you gonna go? Exactly. You move away from me, not towards me, because I'm pushing <laughs> you away. Pushing. I did the wrong spout. foot there. Do you know if your barn in America was certified by the FHS? Or at least some local organization? No, I have no clue. Well, just like with any physical exercise, you need to train consistently to get the bad uh -huh, habits uh -huh. out of your memory. So I recommend you take the guided lessons at least once a week. Let's go! Let's do this! Okay, there, we can do that. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Look at us, we're good. Oh shit, that was a little too tight almost. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh, not in here? Oh. Okay, I have to stay in trot. Okay, okay. 
Okay, okay. Good, good. Good, good. Good, good, good. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. Very, very nice. Oh, oh, that's it. I was like, wait, where do we go? Complete one more exercise and trot. Okay, we are in trot. I would love to go faster, but we have to stay in trot. Kinda did that. We can't. We kind of saw. We still. We still got it. Yes, yes. We still got it. <laughs> we got it. We got it. We got it. Dum 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 really nice it's really nice i would love to do this in real life <laughs> but i don't have like i don't know 400 every month just to take some lessons <sighs> bad life bad life sad sad life Maybe at some point, maybe at some point I will, I will have 400 just every month just laying around that I can use for, for some horse uh, riding lessons. That would be so cool. I always wanted to ride horses, also like back then. The only reason why I was able to take lessons, it wasn't really lessons, it was more like a school school subject that uh, you could choose as like your afternoon exercise whatever and um yeah it Thank was oh, she, she scared me she scared me <laughs> she scared me today's performance i would totally give you the gold patch oh nice nice thank you thank you we did it we did it very, very nice. We did it. Can we already book the next one? Oh, we can. We will probably do that. But maybe another time. <laughs> maybe another time. Because I think, I think we have uh, enough for this video. Yes, yes. We will do this the next time. It was really, really nice though. And uh, I will, I will do my ad moder uh, ad moderation, ad moderation, and moderation. I will be ending the YouTube video here that I'm recording. <laughs> so chat, make su make sure to say bye. Make sure to say bye. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video, and check out the links in the description. And I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Shadows is also saying bye-bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.